Gary, so I have been a chef uh, and event manager for more than two decades. And the philosophy has been you're only as good as your last event. Yes. You're only as good as your last meal. You have been the seminal figure in deconstructing that. So thank you. Thank um, you. Now, in the social media realm, can you speak to that of not letting the perfect be your enemy and just... I, I, I think the imperfect, so first of all, I think intent trumps all. And I think the second you really understand what I just said, you become far more you know, lucid in your communication. I'm never scared to doing the wrong thing, tweeting the wrong thing, promoting too much, because I'll apologize if I really feel like I was wrong. I actually consulted one of my clients to do something wrong on purpose so we could say we're sorry because I think the sorry is more valuable than the status quo. I mean, it's crazy. So to, the reason I'm not crippled by perfection or it has to be perfect or anything of that nature, as a matter of fact, the one thing I've been most scared about with this book coming out is people critiquing what I'm putting out content-wise Against your own speed. Against my own speed because what I'm doing is I'm still testing. So I'm still putting out links that auto-populate the pictures on Facebook because I'm always testing and I'm like, oh man, this is going to be tough to explain because somebody's going to jump in and be like, Gary V, you just you know, wrote a book about you got to make a picture. Why are you doing this? And so, uh, you know, I've never crippled by it because intent matters because when I reply to that person and say, listen, I'm still testing baseline because Facebook's always changing, they're like, oh, there's like more value for me to continue the smarts than me being crippled by doing the wrong thing. So I think it's quite simple. I think that if you're willing to respect your, your, your haters or the people that don't agree or the people that are upset with your last meal, as long as you're willing to respect them and have true dialogue, you can't lose.